Life is Strange, True Colors, Part 3. This will be a good night. Just relax and play some video games, shall we? Let's continue. Chapter 3, Monster or Mortal? You have a superpower? You're both fucking with me, right? Ryan and I look like the fucking with you type? It's all true. Fine. Then tell me what I'm feeling right now. You're feeling disbelief. <sighs> You're actually a little annoyed. You feel hurt that we didn't tell you until now. Whether it's true or not, you don't like being left out. Well, okay. Oh shit, the foosball game. You knew exactly what to do. You needed to focus on the positive memories, not get lost in the sadness. I thought it would help. It did. Just warn me next time, okay? Deal. Never thought I'd have a freaky empath friend. Pretty wild. So, any sign of Diane today? No, but she was in yesterday working on her laptop. You said she was afraid of something around Gabe's death. If she's covering up what Typhon did, I bet there's proof. I hope so. If she comes in today, let's be ready with a plan. In the meantime, I've got to finish my shift. We're on it. Time to earn a paycheck. Crap, I have to finish my shift. I should clean the dirty dishes around the bar. How do these bird washing oh. contests even work? Who's hmm. checking the sightings? Are you questioning my victory? Miranda, I would never. Check on this lady, shall we? Hey, Eleanor. How are you? I'm doing okay. Thank you, dear. I really appreciate your help from a couple weeks ago. It means a lot. Yes, I'm working in a bar. Of course. The game. I'm glad I could help. I... I'm streaming. Thank you. Did you trade out the quarters in the register I... yet? All you, kid. That's, that's not what I meant. It's not what I meant. Not to be a single issue voter or anything, but fuck Typhon. Happy. 
Your tab is in the six figures, Ducky. Chump change. Let's make it 12. Hey, getting ready for the big LARP? Oh, hey, yeah, trying. I hope we can get Ethan into it. So, is everything okay? Yeah. Don't worry, I'm sure he'll like it. Shit, seriously? Yeah, I'm kind of addicted. It's a good game. I'm not convinced this is totally sanitary, but what do I know? with you. I better check in with Steph and Ryan. Okay, she's here. What's the plan? Well, we have two plans, actually. But... We're still workshopping them. Good to have options, right? So what are they? Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. I asked Diane out on a date. Wait, what? And she's so into it. She doesn't notice one Ryan Lucan swiping her laptop. Ryan carries said laptop upstairs, acquiring damning evidence. Maybe Diane and I still hook up? Not important. <laughs> That's your plan? Oh my god, please tell me you have something better. I do. Now to be clear, it's the same plan. Except, I'm the distraction. Look, Steph, I don't even think she's gay, all right? She's probably into the rugged mountain man type. All the transplants are. Wow. <laughs> I'm genuinely worried that these were the best ideas you had. What? It's a simple plan, literally two steps. You just need to choose the hotter distraction. <laughs> okay, I'm not doing that. The only tiebreaker we have. How am I supposed to know if she's into guys or girls? Can I just walk away? Can I walk away? I. Oh God. She's a businesswoman. Let's go with Brian. This, Ryan? This is like a bad dream. Look, I appreciate the... the effort, but we don't even know if she has anything worth stealing yet. I'm just gonna try 
talking to her. Maybe I can get her worked up and read her emotions. I'll let you know if I need that distraction. Good luck. Your usual. Thanks, Alex. What's the best way to rile her up? You know all I want is justice for my brother. Please. Help me. Alex, I can assure you that Typhon is committed to a full and open investigation. We want to find those responsible and hold them accountable just as much as you do. That's the truth. She's got a great poker face, unlike Mac, but let's see what she's really feeling. Let me try and read her first. Poor Gabe. No one deserves to die like that. She said. If I keep her thinking about Gabe's death, maybe I can find out more. That's a nice cross. Oh, thanks. Do you have, um, enough napkins for the table? Uh, yeah. I'm fine, thanks. Typhon does a lot of local hiring, huh? We're always growing. I bet you and Gabe threw back a lot of these together. He was a great bartender. Made the long work days more bearable. William Bloom. Abe loved him. I think he spent a whole year just listening to him. <laughs> really? He had good taste. Surprised we never talked about it. Of all the people this could have happened to, why'd it have to be him? Oh, <laughs> such a cute photo. My niece and nephew. They're adorable. Of all the people this could have happened to, why'd it have to be him? Diane seems really put together, but inside, she's just as much a mess as the rest of us. Are you joining in the LARP later? It's been so hard for Ethan. We're all hoping it will cheer him up. I can't. Good luck, though. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. Okay. Now I need to pick something that will push Diane's emotions over the edge. Look, I know you're not a bad person. But my brother is dead because of the choices you and Typhon made. How does that make you feel? I actually want to know. Alex, I... We... Typhon is doing everything we can to address the situation. That's the truth. Okay? Hmm. All right. That's the emotion I was looking for. Time to explore Diane's guilt about Gabe. OK. 
Okay, time to find out what Diane is really hiding. here looking for a better life, just like me. He's gone. I'm still here. Hello? Miss Jacobs? It's Deputy Pike. Pike, I'm sorry, but we're very busy at the moment. There's been an accident. What kind of accident? Wait, there's something else. I can't undo what Typhon did, or the role I played, but at least I have everything I need to protect myself from them. Holy shit. Hmm. She must have evidence on the USB stick. Oh, looks like I'll need a distraction after all. Ryan, what's up? Well, if you're free later, I was thinking we could go on a hike together. There's some beautiful trails up in the mountains. Oh, that sounds like a nice idea. <laughs> sounds fun. Ryan knows all about the local flora and fauna of Haven. Ryan, tell her about the flora and fauna. Oh, uh, <laughs> well, that right there is a Colorado pinion jay. It can hold more than 40 seeds at a time with an expandable esophagus. That is impressive. So, what do you say? Hey, no rush. He's not going anywhere. Mull it over. Get back to him. Anyway, gotta go. <laughs> See ya. That was an awkward moment. you. I know, I can't believe it. <laughs> hey. Oh, man. I know I'm cracking up, but that was legit terrifying. I hope it was worth the risk. Password protected. Guess I'm not surprised. I'll bring this to Riley, see if she's willing to help. She's a whiz at computer stuff. In the meantime, we have a LARP to do. Grab your hat and meet me at the park. And don't forget your guitar, okay? Is the guitar really necessary? What? 
how can you be a bard without a guitar? The bard's whole job is to musically regale people. Hmm. Well then, prepare to be regaled. So, did you finish the thing? Yeah, barely. It took me all night. I haven't carved like that in ages. All right, I need to grab my guitar and the hat that Steph got me. Wow. Typhon officially clears Typhon of any wrongdoing in Death of Local Man at the hands of Typhon Explosions. Ducky's gift to me for finding his booze. It's, um, it's a unique expression of gratitude. Oh, the old ass screensaver. I used to have that on my computer in the 90s. Old ass computer. Life in Haven would be a lot worse without these two weirdos. A housewarming gift from Eleanor. She said Gabe loved these little dudes. No sunglasses, though. Hmm. We're missing a puzzle piece. I don't like that. We're one step closer now. <laughs> Steph, I will murder you. Wish I'd taken Steph's advice. Ugh. Huh. There it is. Oh, hi there. Now, what do you unlock? Hmm. Good question. Yeah. I don't need to know what that was for. Oh, shit. The feather on the hat must have fallen off. Maybe I can find it. Gabe's last effects from the coroner. Pike dropped it off a few days ago. Yes, I've been avoiding looking through it. Okay. You can take the kid out of juvie.
Oh. One match left. I don't know why, but this must have been really special to Gabe. Never know when you'll need a light. I'm not giving up yet, Gabe. I better find that feather. Steph is a stickler for details. This must have been Gabe's. That's a long list. And I bet he would have gotten through it. Gabe. Still finding ways to break my heart, huh? Wow. Steph is a rock star for putting this together. Ethan is gonna flip. One day, I'll stop being a freeloader. For now, I'm just grateful. I don't even know if I'm doing this right, but it felt like I had to do something. I haven't beat Steph a single time. That just means I'm overdue for a win, right? I know this is Ethan's copy, but I'm level 73 and I'm not stopping. Hmm. Okay, just need to grab my guitar now. Alex the Bard, ready to serve. Time to head out. <laughs>
Hey. I don't need, like, cheering up or whatever. Okay, so maybe this wasn't the most subtle idea, but... Gabe was so excited to LARP with you. I bet he'd really want you to do it. I do want to do this. It's just... <sighs> Everyone's been working so hard. And if I'm not happy, they'll all be disappointed. Must be weird having a bunch of adults pressuring you to dress up in a costume and act like you're having fun. Yeah, especially my mom. She always looks so <sighs> sad. Cause I'm like bummed out. But I can't just pretend. So, don't pretend. Just be yourself. Or yourself with a foam sword and a funny hat. But what if I'm still, you know, not having fun? Then don't. That's fine too. No one will be disappointed in you for being you. All right. But I don't want to do it alone. You have to help me. Of course. Thanor, the monster slayer. Thanks to the gods and all the heavens you've come. I am in desperate need of a great hero. Could you be the one? Please, tell me of your exploits. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff. Maybe my bard can sing something about me. Oh, sure. <laughs> a kraken ate a city every year until it died on Thanor's spear. My goodness. You must be Thanor's bard, Alexandra, whose songs have magical powers. <laughs> it sounds like you are exactly the heroes I need. My name is King Tabor. The age of monsters has come upon my kingdom. Horrible creatures stalk the streets. My people live in constant fear. But this hope, an ancient prophecy, describes three mysterious gems known as soul jewels that can save us all. I need you to go search the kingdom, survive whatever's out there, and bring me back those jewels. Do you understand? Yeah. Yes. Good. Then you <laughs> must go now. My people are counting on you. Should we start with the main road? Okay. Time to find some jewels. This is kind of exciting. How do we know where to look? I think we don't know. It's a true adventure. Oh.
What do you think the jewels are for? Maybe some kind of magic ritual that protects the whole kingdom. Does King Tabor know magic? I guess we'll find out. Is this what a real quest feels like? The jewels could be anywhere. What did you just find? A gold coin. Do you think there's more of them? I don't know. Let's keep looking. A wolf. A dire wolf. Shit, what do we do? I think we have to fight it. <laughs> Stirring him. Double Thanor's next attack. <laughs> Burning blade! Two damage, <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns. <laughs> ah! Two damage. Ah! I'm still on fire! <laughs> it's too funny. Untuned cord, <coughs> one damage. <laughs> Shield of courage. <laughs> Protected by shield of courage. Ah, I'm still on fire. <laughs> <laughs> Loot! Loot. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, cool! I learned a magic attack! <laughs> One damage to allies? Better be nice to Thanor. Let's keep going! What do you think this key is for? Maybe it unlocks something in one of these stores. I should probably drop in on Riley and thank her in person. What is that? It's a magic scroll we can use in fights. Oh, awesome. We should find as many as we can.
Looks like the Black Lantern is part of the LARP. Traveling to some? Hey, let's hear your riddle. There are three, it is said, heroes long dead, fashioned into soul jewels, blue, violet, red. What are their names? Do not be misled. How are we supposed to know that? Maybe we can look for some clues. Hmm. Oh, what's that about? Looks like you dropped something, Diane. <laughs> Wanna look in here? Yeah. Let's go in. What happened here? Fellow survivors, I see. Are you the bartender here? Nope. Monster ate all of the staff. We'll have to serve ourselves. <laughs> Do you know what this key is for? Belonged to Barry, the tavern keeper. That's his leg over there. <laughs> oh. So, if you want to try all of the locks, I'm sure he won't stop you. <laughs> Let's see what we can find around here. I actually feel bad for that person. Okay, I think I checked all the compartments. Steph really went all out in here. <laughs> Someone knows how to keep Feynor busy. Ugh, rough day for Barry the Tavern Keeper. House Bard? Sorry, Steph. Alexandra is pretty happy with her current gig. This kingdom has serious problems. <laughs> oh gosh, I think Ducky dropped this. That better be washable. Here we go. This probably has the answer to that riddle. Steph thought of everything. 
She's amazing at this. Yes, Lawrence is going to need a new business advisor. What happened to the rest of the music? Fainor, did you see this? That's got to be it! It's one of the jewels! One down, two to go. That wasn't so bad, right? Now I feel more confident we can find the others. Glad you finally believe in us. <laughs> That's not what I meant. <laughs> I'm a genius for convincing Steph that my character should be alone behind the bar. All <laughs> the drinks I want. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. Wow. Yes? I see you've poured yourself some ale. You just survived a monster attack. I think you deserve a couple drinks on the house. Truly wise beyond your years. <laughs> How did you survive the attack? Well, I'm not proud of it, but I tripped an elderly woman. <laughs> she had a comment. Stingy dish wench. <laughs> Want to tell them about our quest? We're on a quest to end the Age of Monsters. So you won't have to live in fear anymore. Are you now? Let me give you something that you may find useful. Thanks. I'm gonna go ahead and guess we'll be meeting a snake. We're going to keep looking around. Good luck. We're going to have to deal with this, aren't we? Did you see this warning? Yeah. That's a bad situation. Trolls are ruthless. Bye.
Check out what I found in that chest. Nice work, Thanor. There was some really interesting stuff in there. Now you look pale. Ready to answer? I'll say it once more. There are three, it is said, heroes long dead. Fashioned into soul jewels, blue, violet, red. What are their names? Do not be misled. Their names are... The answer is Nira, Dasis, and Belen. You solved the riddle you've been told. Your prize? A useful hint. Behold. To bribe that deadly troll of old, you have to pay four coins of gold. Four coins. Got it. Ah, there's more. Because you solved my verse, you may take one gold from my purse. Thanks. Can we hear another riddle? Oh, uh, shit. Sorry. I only had one prepared. <laughs> this guy's a fraud, I have declared. <laughs> Not bad, Thanor. Sorry. We gotta get back to our quest. I wish we could go back to the tavern when it's full of people. It was full of people. Alive people. Obviously. Did you say she's Go get him, Ethan. I'm Thanor. Go get him. Could there be something down the alley? This is boring. Why is my dead lover talking? <laughs> Shh, they're here. Woe is me. Woe is me. Behold, my love has been slain by yonder river monster. Where? Just down the... yonder... alley. N near the river. Alas, alas. <laughs> wow. That actually felt really sad. Beware of river monster. Some kind of snake? I guess. <laughs> Do we have to fight it? Why wouldn't we? I mean... It's kind of cute, isn't it? <laughs> what are you talking about? <sighs> it's gonna attack! What do you wanna do? Ophidian chime. Snakes within hearing must fall asleep. Pretend that's a low sound. 
Snake's ears are internal, so they can't hear. Just go to sleep. <laughs> nice. <laughs> More loot. All right, let's make some ears bleed. Hmm. Wait, what's that? It's like a dragon scale or something. Maybe it's got magical powers. Let's hang on to it. Yeah. That was so smart of you to use the bell. It worked out, didn't it? Can't wait to transfix some monsters with my sweet hypnotic jams. think the snake was cute? I actually did, yes. You're weird. Nuh-uh, you are. Found a scroll? Yeah. Okay, we handled the river serpent. Thank you, adventurers. But you should probably clean up that body. with the river serpent, huh? More than just talk, are you? Everything okay? You seem pretty, um, grumpy. I've forgotten the damn components of sun silver. Don't suppose you know the composition? Um, if we find out, we'll tell you. I won't hold my breath. Please knock twice. Go for it. Monster or mortal? Mortal! Come in.
Sorry about the lock. These are dangerous times. Welcome to the Magpie Emporium. Oh, so this is like a magic shop. I'm gonna take a look around a bit, okay? Okay. Let's see what Steph's done to the place. He's forging the Sky Sword of Power. Oh yeah? One day, Thanor's gonna find it. Man, my dating life could have used a truth spell or two. <laughs> You're telling me. Oh, hey, Sun Silver. We should tell that blacksmith. That actually looks legit. Golem, animation fee not included. Oh, Steph. Wonder if they have drills for this. <laughs> spells. Very cute, Steph. Are these spells for sale? To members of the Sorcery Guild only. Sorry. Seeking insight? Draw a card. Huh. What do I want insight about? Is that true for Ryan? I hope so. You were right, Gabe. I'm a superhero. <laughs> I really wish things would stop changing for once. Yikes. Warning. Cat is cursed. Do not pet. Yeah, no need to warn me. Mm. I guess some heroes are into bards with flashy guitars, but I'm glad Thanor has better taste. It's a wonder Valkyrie's ever hungry. What with all the human flesh I assume she consumes. I bet we're supposed to buy something here. Sapphire's right there, for sale. Why is this 10,000 gold? Was I too generous? It was originally 20,000, but... No, I meant... Never mind. Maybe we can... Would you consider giving us that sapphire? For free? Of course not. 
We need the sapphire right away. It's for a quest to end the age of monsters. I've heard there's a magical fish that lives in the River of Sorrows. Bring me back one of its scales, and I'll give you the sapphire in return. One magic fish scale. Impressive. Well, then here's my end of the bargain. Only one more jewel left. Getting there. Hey, we found the components of Sun Silver. It's iron, goblin ore, and fire powder. Praise the gods. Of course. How could I forget? Why don't you take that scroll for your kindness? I've no need of it. Got another scroll. Cool. Come on. Monster abundances are when you need apothecaries the most. Aw. Disappointed? I thought I would finally get to go in. <laughs> We're like master scroll seekers. Yep. How Riley's doing with the USB. Mind if I duck in here a second? I have to, um, renew my bar guild membership. Yeah. Okay.
Hey there. <laughs> I could ask Riley how progress is going with the USB. Any luck with the USB? No, not yet. It's gonna take hours, if we're lucky. Oh. If you want to check it out, it's running on the office computer. But don't touch anything. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much for doing this. You don't have to thank me. It's the least I could do for Gabe. And honestly, it's a nice distraction for me right now. Is everything okay? I found out Nana has been sick. She has Alzheimer's. Oh, wow. Anyway, let's talk about something else. Are you still going to school? Oh, no. I turned them down. Nana told me not to, but she's going to need help. That must have been a hard decision. No. I knew what I had to do. What's hard is dealing with the disappointment. How's Mac doing? I haven't seen him in a while. Oh, he's around. Probably too embarrassed to show his face. <laughs> He has been helping Nana a lot. I'm sure he's just trying to get back together with me, but it kind of doesn't matter. I'm grateful he's here. Let's talk later. I'll let you know if I make any progress. Thanks again. I wonder what we'll find at the Bridge of Flowers. I wonder what we'll find at the Bridge of Flowers. Courage. 
healing serenade. Plus one health to us. Throwing rock. Protected by shield of courage. Burning blade. One damage. <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns. Horrid Disharmony, three damage. <clears throat> Throwing rock. <gasps> Two damage. Ah, I'm still on fire. Fire Blast. Three damage to you. <clears throat> One to her. Sorry. Worth it. Healing Serenade. Plus one health to us. Stunning punch. Ah, stunned. Ah, I'm still on fire. <clears throat> Two damage. <sighs> Double slam. Oh, ah. Untuned cord. <clears throat> One damage. <clears throat> Throwing rock. Ah. Two damage. Healing serenade. Plus one health to us. Burning blade. One damage. <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns. Throwing rock. Protected by shield of courage. Ah, I'm still on fire. Hypnotic fugue. All enemies are transfixed. Shield of courage. Transfixed by the music. Can't move. Ah, I'm still on fire. Here, look what else I got. We've got all three. We can go back to the king now. Yep. Okay. That troll was scary. I admit it. Nothing to admit. It's just facts. Being scary definitely lends a battle advantage. and drop this. Oh my God, it's my mom. 
<laughs> Thanor, the monster slayer, you've come at last. Do you remember me from your past adventures? You're Netheria, the forest spirit. You have done well on your quest. The forest notices. She offers a treasure for you to claim. Look, there. What is that? The Sky Sword. It's the Sky Sword of Power! It's exactly the same as I drew in the comics! It's got the pincer, and the same grip, and it's got this part for the jewels. How do they do it? Can I really take it? Of course. Netheria said so, right? Okay. A song, if you please. The prophecies fulfilled at last. Now Thanos' might is unsurpassed. <laughs> That sword now and the jewels. Gravius, <laughs> Lord of the Underworld. I should have known King Tabor was you all along. You fools! You have collected the jewels I need and brought them right to me. We've gotten this far. We can beat him. Give them to me! <laughs> it should be interesting. Whoa! <laughs> Healing serenade. of wrath! Oh. <laughs> oh. Horus is harmony. Oh. Hmm. 
<laughs> Burning blade! Oh. Ring of fire! No! <laughs> uh. Curse this fire! I summon the fury of hell! Death to all who defy me! Serenade. healing.
Listen to me. It wasn't your fault. At all. It wasn't. Okay? It wasn't. Charlotte? Back here. Hey. Thanks for coming. Of course. Ethan's dad already pick him up? Yeah, they just left. I just wanted to thank you. Ethan needed today. It was a group effort, but I'm glad I could help. He thinks the world of you, you know. After everything, I think you're sort of a zero. Mm. He's sort of mine. How creative he is. You must be so proud of him. He was so thrilled to see you show up with the sword. I think that was mostly about the sword. Maybe. But I think he was happy to see you in his world. <sighs> sorry. I'm sorry. I'm okay. Charlotte? God, Alex, don't mind me, okay? Just a lot going on. I don't mind you at all. Do you want to talk about it? You're really sweet, but I'm okay. Thanks for swinging by. I'll... See you at the festival? Are you sure? If you want company, I'm- Said no! Fuck, don't you listen? Shit. This was a mistake. Where did that anger come from?
anger is so intense. Maybe there's something here that can tell me why. Alex, it's your fault. Everyone loves you. But I can't look at you without thinking about how fucked everything is since you came into my life. Ryan, it's your fault. You were supposed to protect us. Why couldn't you? Gabe, it's your fault. Why would you teach me to need someone again just to go and leave me all alone? She's so angry at everyone around her, but there's something else here. What is wrong with me? I can't let myself feel this way. When did I become such a fucking monster? Ethan! It's your fault! Why couldn't you just fucking listen? You're angry at him. At Ethan. You blame him. I'm a bad mom, Alex. Charlotte. <laughs> Charlotte. I hate my son, Alex. He's sweet, and he's creative, and he's the most important thing in the entire universe to me. And I hate him. For so long, it was just me and him. It took so long to learn how to be okay with that. And I was. But then, Kate. I can deal with hating Ryan, or you, or even Gabe, but Ethan, if he had j listen, it all comes back to that. What you're feeling makes more sense than you think. Your pain matters too. None of it fucking matters! He's dead! <sighs> I wish I were too. This anger could kill her, and nothing I'm saying is helping. What if... I could just take it away. I can do it. I can take her anger from her. What would that do to her? What would it do to me? And even if I can, 
Should I? I'm sorry, Charlotte. I wish I could do something. That makes two of us. I think that might have been the hardest decision out of this whole game. But I don't believe that you should take somebody's feelings away from them. At least that's what I think. You have to feel it to be okay with it later. I hope. Okay, okay. Hear me out. Is Typhon run by the Illuminati? That would explain the conspicuously triangle-shaped logo. Boom! Finally cracked it. Hey. Alex. So, how did things go with Charlotte? Honestly, I think she'd want me to keep what happened just between us. Sorry. Of course. Don't apologize. So please tell me that the USB stick revealed all of Typhon's secrets. Not yet, but Alex. We found a recording of Gabe's call. I should probably listen to that. I need to know. We're here for you, okay? Type in safety. Mac? It's me. Fuck off, Chen. Yeah, yeah, okay, just listen. I need you to call off the explosion. Ethan's in the blast radius. Shit. He could get killed. What the hell's wrong with you? He snuck off. We're, we're up here right now, trying to find him. Mac, please. All right, I'm on it. We'll halt the blasts. Fuck. You can't imagine the headaches this will create for me. Thanks, Smack. Whatever. Just doing my job. They just ignored him. <laughs> That's so fucked. You know it's bad when Mac turns out to be the good guy. You okay? We're taking these fuckers down. This USB stick has what I need. Time to dig through it. Gabe's call came in from the sat phone at 8.41 p.m. I should find the next call and see if that has any information.
Lena? It's Diane. We have a problem. You're kidding. There's a kid lost in the mountains near the pit. We need to postpone. Lena? Haven is your site, Diane, and therefore this is your decision. I know I don't need to remind you of the stakes. Someone could be hurt. Or killed. We've been over this. Anyone up there has disregarded posted notices and accepted full liability. We're talking about a child. I'm just asking for one day. If you postpone tonight's scheduled blast, you put Rhea in jeopardy. That puts the whole company in jeopardy. Is that what you want? No. Then do the math and make the right call. Email me when it's done. I will. What the hell is Rhea? Must have been pretty damn important. Maybe Diane says more about it in her email? Maybe. Let me see if I can find it. This is the email Diane mentioned. So what is Rhea? Seems like a lot is hanging on these inspections. Damn, is this what Diane sold her soul for? Too bad money can't fix all of Typhon's problems. Who would have thought getting away with murder would be so... bureaucratic? The timing of all this is too convenient to be a coincidence. Is it safe to assume you've gotten your emotions under control? My emotions? Someone was killed last night because of a decision you made. I think- I would be very careful with what you say next. Who do you think is more at risk here? Me or you? Excuse me? Now, of course, we're all committed to helping you make it through this difficult period. We don't want to see anyone be scapegoated over an unavoidable accident, right? Right. Great. Then you and I are aligned. Who else knew there were people in the mountains? Just my safety manager, Mac. He got their distress call just before I contacted you. Do you trust him? I... I think I can convince him to be trustworthy. Good. Good. Only one point of contact, and you've got him handled. I think we're going to make it through this just fine. Speak to you soon. Okay. I refuse to feel bad for Diane in all this, but... Damn. HNB Investigations. Bennett speaking. Hi, Bennett. This is Diane Jacobs. Lena told me. Yep. Been expecting your call. Okay. I'm not sure what the next step is. Just need all the pertinent information on the employee in question. Name, number, address, significant others. We'll handle the rest. I see. Just come by the office. My secretary will take everything down. No records that you were even there. Got it. Okay. I'll come by tomorrow. Looking forward to it. It's so gross that Typhon has people watched. Typhon Mining, this is Brandon. Hello. I'm calling from the Department of Land and Resources to confirm the inspection set for next week. Yeah, let me grab Diane for you. Thanks. This is Diane. Hi, Diane. I'm calling to... Confirm inspections? <laughs> yes. Did you have a chance to look over the email I sent? I did. Everything looks great. Glad to hear it. I'll see you Thursday. Seems like a lot is hanging on these inspections. This is the email Diane mentioned. Rhea went off undetected. Was there a second blast that night? They only had permits for one. 
What did Lena say? Without the scheduled blast, Rhea would be discovered? Shit. The blast that killed Gabe was just a cover for another explosion? We didn't hear another explosion, though. It must have gone off somewhere else. If we can find out where it was, that might tell us what it was for. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Hello, Diane. My name is Rory Praha. I'm a journalist with the Rocky Mountain Gazette. We'll be printing a story on last night's accident in the paper tomorrow. Would you like to provide a comment? Yes, I would. Last night's accident was tragic, and made all the more unfortunate by the fact that it could have been avoided with a simple phone call. A simple phone call? Can you speak more about that? Of course. Typhon always has a safety manager on duty. One quick call from Mr. Chen to our 24-hour emergency line would have alerted us that there were people in the danger zone, and we could have reacted accordingly and stopped the blasts. Are other Haven citizens in danger of meeting the same fate as Gabe Chen? Absolutely not. As long as you heed the warning signs, you will be safe. And if you ever do find yourself in an emergency, that's what our emergency line is for. There's no danger whatsoever. All right. We'll be sure to include your comments. Thanks for giving me your time, Diane. Have a nice day. I almost threw up listening to that. Same. This is ACFC. How can we feed you? Is the good pickin' chicken thing still going on? Itch. Mace Flowers, this is Riley. How can I help you? Hey, Bev, it's me. Hi, Belt Plumbing. How can I help you? Hi, I'm, uh, I'm of Typhon Mining. I think we had one of your plumbers up here last week. Typhon Mining. Uh, give me just one second to check our records. Yes, I have a record of a service call regarding some sewage backup. Yeah, yeah, that's... Yeah, so, um, I don't think it's fixed. The field report I have says that the issue was diagnosed and solved. Can you describe what you're seeing? Oh, uh, you, you know, I, I really can't. Look, can you just send someone? I'll have someone out to you later this afternoon. Great. Have a nice day. Yeah, I doubt it. Nasty. Typhon Mining, this is Brandon. Hello, I'm calling from the Department of Land and Resources to confirm the inspection set for next week. Yeah, let me grab Diane. Typhon Safety. Mac? Lena? It's Diane. We have a problem. Lena. Hello, Diane. Is it safe to assume you've gotten your emotions under control? My emotions? HNB Investigations. Ben is speaking. Hi, Ben. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Diane, it's, uh, it's Jason. Hello, Deputy. You have good news for me? Hi. Suppose I do. You are officially cleared to continue regular operation. Diane has dossiers on the entire Haven Council. That's not creepy at all. This is Rhea. Fuck. This map's too small to tell where this is. I need a map. That's the site of the 2008 Typhon mine collapse. Wait, they set off a blast in their current mine to cover up a blast in their old mine? That shaft was exhausted years ago. There's nothing left to dig up. What could possibly be down there that's so important to them? Typhon just had to pass a bunch of inspections at the old site, didn't they? Yeah, so? So, I don't think they were digging something up. They were burying something. Hmm. And the plot thickens, does it? Apparently more people prefer to choose the girl in this game. <laughs> hmm. That's a lot of multiple quiet and multiple <sighs> answers.
That's right, I was never knocked out in battle. Aha. Oh, the troll was killed in battle. Wait. Huh. That's funny. Uh, serpent was put to sleep. Yes, the cute serpent was not killed. Hey, 100%. Everybody did that one. Or got that one. Huh? Wait, how am I the only one? A hundred percent on she didn't know? Well, maybe Riley should have found out. It's not a good thing to hide that from your family. At least I don't think so. <laughs> well... People who played this game actually kept it away from her. That's, uh, that's sad. That's sad. Well, that's it for tonight. Thank you for joining me with this chapter, and... Kind of been having a moment with some family issues, and so that's why I've been so quiet tonight, but, uh... You know, that's why I play video games. It kind of helps me get out of my head. And it helps me to relax. That's why I play video games. It helps me escape. If just for a little bit. So thank you for joining me. And please, don't hesitate. Follow. Check out my YouTube linked in my bio. I have a full collection of Life is Strange, among other great games that you might enjoy. <laughs> um, don't forget to check out my Instagram for updates on my shop. I've added new photos, which I am extremely proud of. <laughs> and uh, See you next time. Again, thank you for joining me, and uh, I love your faces. <laughs> Good night, everybody.